this is a 1 million dollar uh, luxury homes uh, the builder is called uh, nv homes and uh, this is uh, one of the luxury builders in america and this model is uh, in maryland central maryland and uh, these are the woods besides this uh, model and the construction there uh, they are uh, some more houses being built by nv homes there and uh, here on this side also uh, they are going to build uh, besides this other uh, home and this model is called tyler and this is a two car garage here and they put uh, chairs as a way to show that people can sit here in the evenings or uh, in the good weather conditions so front entry door and this is how they decorated the we can say hallway the hallway is decorated like this and this is the office room and they have a decent size office room here and looks like it 10 by 10 or 12 by 12 size office room and going inside that is the dining area and separate uh, room here and uh, the lighting even though it's fully cloudy outside we have enough light inside with the big windows and this is how they decorated and this is way to the basement and this is way to the upstairs and they put 42 inch wide oak staircase and this is the living area looks like a 76 inch tv and even with the cloudy outside uh, this is ample lighting inside with uh, these recess lights and the outside lighting itself this looks like a decent size living area and uh, this is the kitchen and this is the ma looks like usb charging outlet is here and this looks like a marble kitchen counters and stainless steel appliances and there is an, another small dining area here and double oven and the dishwasher is here and stainless steel uh, uh, water faucets here and let's go this way this is the pantry walk in pantry and here we have the coat closet and this is going to be the two car garage and a decent size two car garage and this is the temperature control settings and the um, gas cooking with uh, five burners and there seems to be a setting here let's go to the deck and the basement you can see it's a walk up walk up basement 
we need to walk a few steps up to get to the ground level and this is the garden they laid out with some trees in the back and there is another tv they they have here with fireplace so even in uh, winter the residents here can sit here and the deck is of decent size here appears to be 10 foot by 14 foot and that's the road and the other lots are going to be on that inter interior uh, service road so. and some other uh, houses are going to be built by these NV homes builder there where the proclaimer is there and some other are behind that uh, town homes there and some controls are here for this fireplace uh, looks like this fireplace is of multicolor. So whatever color you like, your mood asks you to do, you can select that color. Going inside, and this appears to be a very decent size uh, uh, kitchen island here. And uh, let's go upstairs now and there is a chandelier here and uh, everywhere in the house there are recess lights and ample lighting throughout the house and this is the master bedroom and the tray ceiling it's a very wide master bedroom and this is uh, one closet you can call it as a his closet and this is a her closet here it seems and a lot of uh, scenic views from here And this is how they decorated and uh, there is a temperature setting here. And the bathroom here looks very attractive. It's the same marble that's used in the kitchen countertops. It's the same marble for this flooring here. Line and closet, and uh, one vanity this side, and another vanity over to the other side there. The vanity all the line and closet also has the marble flooring, and uh, here they have carpeted. The bedroom and the walk-in closets this is how they decorated above the bed and going to the hallway and they have ample space here for uh, sit out and there is a provision to put a TV here and this is another bedroom which is of decent size and uh, here also it seems like 8 foot ceilings here and uh, recess lights are there everywhere and this is how they decorated
and there is a walk-in closet here and this bathroom here seems to be a common bathroom for the other bedroom straight opposite to this and this bedroom here where we are standing and this uh, bathroom is called Jack and Jill bathroom and this appears to be a 10 foot height compared to the bedroom bedroom is only 8 foot appears to be 8 foot and these are the two vanities here With all stainless steel faucets uh, completely up to the top ceiling the tiles are there the toilet room and this is the view from here ample lighting throughout the house and these are the eight foot high rooms and this is another bedroom here and the views are like this from this room and this is how they decorated that is a walk-in closet for this bedroom and going out to the hallway and into the other bedroom here which is going to be a fourth bedroom on top stairs and this is how they decorated and lighting is everywhere and this is the walk-in closet here and there is an attached bathroom to this particular bedroom and this is how they decorated it single vanity there and Korean countertop there and regular flooring is there here not uh, a marble flooring like in the master bedroom and the, all the bedrooms are carpeted and the hallway here is a hardwood hard, hardwood flooring and here there is a shelving here you can put line and towels here and here they have a provision for the washer and dryer clothes washer and dryer and coming back into the main hallway it's the master bedroom with the attached master bathroom and that one has a another second room with attached bathroom and the other two bedrooms here has a jack and jill bathroom so it's a common bathroom common full bath so here we have three four bedrooms and uh, three full bathrooms here on the top stairs going back down see all the windows with full lighting coming in and this is how they decorated the walls Now over 
over the island also they have three pendant lights and here is the half uh, bathroom or powder room we can say in the mid level and this is the way to the basement and they have a wall hanging here and the, these stairs are also wide enough so uh, large furniture can easily come down when any movers come with furniture and this is how they decorated the basement area and this is the wet wet bar area they they had and they have different uh, floor tiling here and different uh, counter tops uh, slate style counter tops and a small refrigerator here and a small dishwasher here recess lights are there throughout the house and this is how they decorated the basement and there is a tv provision over there and there is a full bathroom here a standing shower and a single vanity here with the uh, Korean counter and this is this is the wide widest uh, basement we can say and those are the game tables we can go there in a minute and uh, this is how they decorated the space here and there is a mirror here hanging to the wall and this is a stone stone front like a stone front they built here the one side of the wall and the glass uh, doors which is uh, getting in the light also from here into the house and this is the walk up basement and they have one two three four steps And this is the elevation you can see once these trees grow large you will have a good amount of privacy even when you are sitting on the deck here vinyl siding for the house going into the house again Oops. some storage area and they carpeted it here and this is the game room there are two pool tables here and a good amount of space also around the tables here and this is the eight foot uh, ceilings with uh, ample recess lights and this looks to be a, the cable company wiring like uh, internet wiring behind those white wooded frames and this is how the view is from this corner of the house
and this is the utility room and that appears to be 80 gallon water heater and this is the end of our tour thank you for watching